Well, I'm checking to check it out. So, um, so I come across um, an article. Well, it's a story, like you know, news. I don't watch. I don't watch TV, so I don't know whether it was on terrestrial channel news. I don't know, but I seen it on YouTube, and um, the story was about how a woman. Um, woman, she had a kid. I think, the, I think the baby was about a year and a half, two years old. Um, she um, she met a postal postal worker. The guy moved in, and uh, basically the guy killed the baby um, by throwing. You know, I think I think I think he threw the child across somewhere, like hit, and the baby hit the head, hit his head, and then died. And that wasn't the first time um, that's happened in terms of being abused. Like, according to the story, he was abused um, a few on a few occasions. If you want to check the story out, check go to a Gangster Times YouTube channel, and you will see it on there. I think you I think you uploaded it about two days ago. But anyway, what what I'm trying to get to the point, of what I'm talking about is. Right, these women out here, right? These women. Also, quickly to add to that story as well. Before I forget, she tried to pin the abuse on the baby and the real baby's dad. Right. So just imagine that. Just imagine what kind of wickedness, spitefulness, hate you're gonna have towards the old child's dad to pin. The abuse from another man Unto him But anyway <clears throat> The point of what I'm trying to make is, is that These women these days right These women right They have kids with somebody um, And The biological dad Usually gets thrown to the wayside As soon as another man comes Into the picture yeah And these women will Quickly move a man in Yeah these, 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 You don't know the man But anyway These women will move a, Basically a stranger in Yeah Whoever they're with Move them in Play happy families And before you know it That kid's getting abused Mentally Physically Or even get killed It happens This, this is a common thing Right This is common and you know, it just fuck, it, it, it fucking sickens me. It really sickens me because I'm in a similar situation, right? I don't get to see my daughter, my daughter, for no reason, right? She decided, you know, over over the years, she made it continually, continually hard and more difficult for me to see my daughter to the point where. She got she she got my daughter to send me a text to say that she said to say that my daughter like basically the text said that the text was from my daughter which said to me that I don't want to I don't want to see you no more and this is like completely random and but I can tell by the way the text was written right someone of her age at the time wouldn't have said that so I know her mum put up to it her mum put her up to it but anyway. Yeah, so I'm, you know, I'm not there, <clears throat> and who knows what what man she's got in my daughter's life at the moment or whatever. Who know? I don't know. Yeah, and this shit could be happening to my daughter. This shit could happen. This shit, this shit could be happening to a lot of dads out there who can't see their their son or their daughter or whatever, right? And now, and now, some other next man. Is in the, you know some of the next man is on the scene, yeah, doing all types to the fucking kid, right? And these women don't learn, man. They don't learn, right? They like for something like they 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 really quick to ostracize the you know the biological dad for even no reason or for some bullshit reasons. And as soon as they get a next man, move that next man in, play happy family, and all this shit. And then when that shit, you know, and then 
that shit never lasts. You heart most time more time than that, it don't last. It doesn't last. Yeah, and then and then that guy leaves, and then back to square one again. You know, sometimes like, oh yeah, night. You know, then then it'll be then it'll be then they'll be sometimes okay for you to to see the child, or the minor. You know, it's happened again. It's happened to me. Not 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 necessarily. Yeah, with, with my daughter's mom and my, and my son's mom. I was never really, I, I was never stopped from seeing my son's uh, from seeing my son. But when she got with a dude, yeah, all of a sudden. It was like trying to get blood out of stone to try and see my son, yeah. So, and then, you know, when all that died down, you know, after being together for a little while, I was able to see my son a bit more. And then, hey ho, that dude ain't around no more. That dude's gone. <laughs> so you see, so again, I've experienced it on that side. I've experienced it. On the other side as well, where I'm on about like being abused by someone who's not my dad. Now I'm not on about like sexual and nothing like that. I'm on about physically and mentally abused, right? Again, I w I've been on that side where my mom brought in the fucking stranger into my life. She, to me, he's a stranger, but brought a stranger into my life, and he made my fucking life hell ever since I was 19 years old up until the split up when I was about 15. Okay, um, you know, you know, these the, the, they're sort of fucked up with these women out here, man. I just don't, I, I don't understand it. You know, um, again, it can end up real tragic to the point where you know these people, these men, will 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 kill someone else's, will kill another man's child, you know, from abuse. Or if they don't kill them, they can they can severely mentally scar them, mentally and physically for life. But these women don't fucking see that at the time, though. They, like they're blind to it, or they give a fuck about oh, oh this man's you know oh I really like this guy, you know this guy's coming into my life, I really like him, move him in, pay happy families and all this shit, man. You women make me fucking sick. You women make me fucking sick, I'm telling you. Women, you women are fucking evil, twisted, and fucked up. Right. <clears throat> but um you know you women out here, you need to start making better choices in men. Right? You need to start making better choices in men. And that's that can't be no that can't be so that that's gotta be really that's so important when you when you, when it, when there's someone else's kid is involved. Right, you know, if you wanna if you wanna make bad choices as a as a woman, and and you're a single woman, no kids, fair enough, that's on you. But when there's a kid involved, you've got to go above and beyond to know who the fuck you're dealing with. Right, you know, I can no again, I, I can speak from what I'm talking about. I can speak from. Experiences from all angles Call it a triangle I've, I've experienced it from um, Me being Not be No me being um, Not being able to see my kids Or me being actual um, A victim of abuse From um, A man My mum decided to move in And I can talk about Me getting involved with women with kids so I can I've, I've got a broad range of spectrum. I've got I've got I've got a hell of a lot of experience with all of this. So I know what the fuck I'm talking about. Yeah. And obviously, when I've when I've been with certain women and I've you know they've introduced me to their kids, they, they got to know me and whatever. You know that's. I'm, but I'm, I'm a normal I'm a normal guy. I'm I'm not fucked up in the head. <coughs> so they want. So they weren't gonna. So when I've been with women who had kids, right. You know, and I was in amongst them. We'd go out here and there. Sometimes I would be, I would be with the mom and the kids. You know, whatever. There would have been no, no. There's no them kids, right? They won't have, they won't have a bad experience about me. They won't have 
any negative feelings about me because I never done anything to him. Never, never mentally abused him. Never physically abused him. Never sexually abused him. Done, done, done none of that. Whenever I've been around someone else's kids, I've always been polite. I've treated them. I've treated them how I would treat my own kids. To, you know, to, you know, to a point. Obviously, I'm not their their bio, biological dad, but to a point, you know. And that's that. So you know that, you know. So the um, the kids that who, who've, who've known me over the years, when I've been with their mom, they won't have any negative experience about me. They don't even you know they might not remember as the years go by, but they won't have any they won't have any negative um, repercussions from that. You know what I mean? Come a fucking normal human being, yeah. So yeah, you mean start making better choices in men. Stop moving fucking men in, yeah. That you know, that you know, in a fucking month or so. Stop moving fucking men in the house, yeah. Stop playing happy families with a new guy when you don't really know who the fuck they are, yeah. You need to li you need to limit it. You need to limit the interaction with with the uh, your kids with with, with with another man. You need to limit it, okay. You know, looking and looking back at it now, I think most women, most women I got with who had kids, I kind of met their kids pretty quickly, pretty early on. But, and that's cool by me because you know I'm, I'm you know, I'm. What's the word? I'm trying to think of the word. Um, usually people can tell Usually people, people can tell if, You know people people can Most people Not most people but You know Sometimes you can just tell If someone's a decent person On the off Or you know Pretty early on And you know And they You know I, I like to believe that The The kid You know I like to believe that but I had to believe that the um, that the women I got with um, knew that early on. Hence, why they, you know, I sent, you know, kind of got introduced to their kids early on. You know, they could tell that I wasn't no fucking dickhead or anything like that. You know what I mean? But but yeah, but I did, like I said, on the other hand, I can I can fully understand if I was kept away from the kids for a long time until they felt comfortable with being introduced. You know what I mean? Because on the whole, women are not really good judges of character on the whole. They're not. So a lot of women out there putting their kids at risk. Hoping that the guy that they meet is gonna, you know, is gonna be real good, you know. Real good to them, real good to their kids. They, they, they just a lot of them a lot of them are just going out. They're just, they're just fucking paying a lottery with that one. You know? Again, some women will be good judges of character and they can tell early on, you know, who's a decent who's a decent guy, you know what I mean? But not you know, but mo I don't think most women do, to be quite honest. But yeah, women need to start making better choices, man. Need to start making better choices. You know, I'm sick of hearing these stories, man. These stories are getting these stories are, are all are all too common, right? And bro, just, just imagine, like if I if I heard, if I heard some man, some man has done something to my daughter or to my son, I would even like I would even like to know, man. I would, I don't know. I don't even want to go there and think. I don't want to think about it. To be honest, I, I really don't. Because, whew. wow. Don't ever want to think about it. Really don't. And it's what these women don't understand. It's like it affects so many people. Your bad choices in men, yeah. Your carelessness in men will have profound effects on so many people. Not only the kid or kids. 
whether they're alive still or even dead but then the kids other side of the family as well so the dad the grandparents the aunties the uncles the cousins you know and that's on that side of the mind on that, on the mother's side all right <sighs> crazy but anyway that's all i gotta say about that anyway that's all i gotta say with that so yeah go check the video out it's on um gangster times youtube channel and um yeah there are some good stories on there a lot of them stories don't get don't get put on normal tv for whatever reason but they don't so go check out scar city studios as well scar city studios on youtube and gangster times on youtube go check them channels out but anyway with that i'm out